By now we all know that Apple takes privacy pretty seriously. So it's that time of the year again, iOS 14 is out and in this video I'm going to show you the best privacy features of course in iOS 14. Hello there, I'm Aman Rashid and welcome to Gadgets 360. Before we begin, please go ahead and subscribe to our channel and do hit that bell icon so you're notified whenever a brand new video drops. Now let's get started. In iOS 14, recording indicators let you know when an app accesses your phone's camera or microphone. Is Facebook secretly using your camera or microphone? Now you can find out. Whenever an app uses your phone's microphone or camera, you will see a small dot right above the battery icon in the control center. A green dot signifies that your camera is being accessed and a yellow dot signifies that the microphone is being used. You can go to the control center to know which app recently used the phone's mic or camera. While using Safari in iOS 14, a new privacy report feature now stops websites from tracking your browsing information. To access the privacy report in Safari for a particular website, you simply hit the AA button in the top left and tap Privacy Report. This will show you the data from the last 30 days. Coming later this year, Apple will show a dedicated privacy page for each app on the App Store. This way, as a user, you'll be able to know what data the app may collect and whether that data can be used to track you. With the help of clipboard notifications, you can now find out exactly when an app accesses your phone's clipboard. You get a quick notification whenever any app accesses your clipboard and it is also a good way to find out whether a particular app is using your data without consent. Many apps request access to your location to give you certain useful features such as directions in Google Maps. However, they don't always need access to your precise location. In iOS 14, Apple has introduced an approximate location feature that lets you share your location in a less targeted way. For instance, whenever you turn off the precise location of an app in Location Services, that app can no longer know your exact location and can only have an approximate idea of where you are, hence better protecting your location privacy. With iOS 14, you can now limit whether an app can access your entire photos library or only a selected bunch. This way, social networking apps won't have access to your entire photos library and better of all, you can only give access for the photos that you'd actually want to share on such sites. An app will always ask for your permission before accessing your photos library. By enabling private feature in your Wi-Fi settings, you can basically prevent your phone from getting tracked by network operators across different Wi-Fi networks. To turn on this feature, go to your Wi-Fi settings, select the Wi-Fi network and enable private address. With this new feature, apps will always ask for your permission before accessing your local network. You can go to Settings, Privacy, Local Network and disable the setting for any app that you think doesn't have any business in accessing your local network. Instead of sharing your contacts details with third-party apps, you can now simply type any of your contacts name and your phone will auto-fill their details for you. For instance, with this feature, you can revoke contacts access for apps such as Paytm. When sending money, type the name of the contact and you'll see an autofill suggestion with the contact's phone number. 
This way you can avoid uploading your entire address book on the internet and still not lose out on the convenience of quickly entering phone numbers or email addresses. The last privacy feature on the list will require third-party apps to ask for permission whenever they want to track you across their websites. Now the thing is that this feature will be coming to iOS 14 next year because Apple wants to give developers some more time to comply with the changes. This new feature can be found in privacy settings in iOS 14 and you can disable it to automatically deny apps the permission to track you across the internet. These were the best privacy features that Apple has brought for users in iOS 14. Let me know in the comments which one is your favorite and as always smash the like button and share this video with others. That's all for now. Thanks for watching and for all things tech log on to gadgets360.com.